Debug visuals. Trace points and occlusion value amounts can be visualized for a better understanding of how the enhanced audio occlusion component is working. Partial occlusion. Utilizing satellite trace points, occlusion occurs more gradually for the sound. Each point contributes a specific amount to the sound's overall occlusion, providing a more natural shift between occlusion states. Audio source diameter. The size of the sound can be adjusted for varying audio source sizes, providing an extra level of customization. Accumulative occlusion. Occlusion isn't restricted to the first object traced from the audio source. Using multi-line traces and custom physical materials, the user can set a custom occlusion amount on a per-material basis. This means that there can be several occluding objects between the listener and the audio source, and all of these objects can be included in the overall occlusion calculations. Center weight. The center of the audio source can be weighted from a value of almost nothing to 100% of the sound's occlusion consideration. This means that the center weight of 0.5 or 50% will allow the center trace to account for half of the overall occlusion contribution. Smart audio positioning. The audible source of the sound can adjust its position as satellite trace points are obstructed to simulate a soft diffraction of the sound. This simulates the perceived source of the sound to originate from an unobstructed portion of the overall sound source size. Blueprint event for third-party programs. An event has been exposed to the enhanced audio occlusion component in Blueprints. By not assigning a sound to the component, you can instead use this exposed event to drive parameters in a third-party program. The event fires only when occlusion values change. Variable number of satellite points. The number of satellite points can be adjusted to reduce raycasts. The Enhanced Audio Occlusion component supports anywhere from two satellite trace points to a max of 12. Max Trace Range Once the listener passes outside of the adjustable max trace range, all trace functions stop for the Enhanced Audio Occlusion component. LOD Trace Range While the listener is within the max trace range and outside of the LOD or Level of Detail trace range, the Enhanced Audio Occlusion component only traces a single trace to the center of the sound. This is to reduce the complexity of sounds that are too far away from the listener to warrant the extra information the satellite traces may give. Multi-line or single-line trace. The enhanced audio occlusion component can trace single-line traces as well. This will only return the first blocking hit's occlusion information. Trace complex. By default, the enhanced audio occlusion component will trace for materials with a complex trace. If this option is disabled, it will instead trace per object and read any custom physical material override on the object for its occlusion values. Occlusion Check Interval The Occlusion Check Interval tells the Enhanced Audio Occlusion component how often to check for occluding objects. If using satellite trace points, each point is traced individually, making a complete rotation of traces each Occlusion Check Interval. This limits the amount of concurrent traces happening per frame. 